Madison's own Malodois certainly has a unique sound. The band combines early century French swing music with a Hawaiian flair as they entertain happy hour crowds on the east side. Photojournalist Christopher Habaker takes us to Mickey's Tavern to listen in on these morning notes. <laughs> Mickey's Tavern, which is our oldest residency in town. I've been coming back here twice a month for well over three years now. Malodois is kind of a eclectic combination of French swing music and early Hawaiian music. It's joyful, it's happy, it's up-tempo. Yeah, people really dig it. We call it uh, a hot Hawaiian and French guitar sorcery. It's like early acoustic, hot, you know, hot, fiery, Gypsy jazz meets kind of this nice, flowy uh, Hawaiian music. Like especially with the Hawaiian music, it doesn't necessarily makes sense that a German-Belgian, a Madison-born guy and a French guy are playing Hawaiian music, but we can, if we have a chance to explain it, it all makes sense. The funny part is that Chris is the American guy flat-picking uh, swing manouche, traditional French gypsy music. And I was the French guy doing finger style. I'm from northern France, Champagne region, in the town called Reims. We thought, well, let's try to blend both styles. And it turned out we had a whole lot of fun. So the duo was making a lot of noise. Fell in love with jazz right around the time when it was those bands like Big Bad Voodoo Daddy and the, kind of the swing revival in the early 90s. That kind of like got my ear into jazz, and so from that, I got into you know Miles Davis, Coltrane, early jazz, jazz guitar, that kind of stuff. Johnny Cash, Carl Perkins, Gene Vincent, and of course Elvis and Jerry Lee. So I grew up listening to a lot of that. I started strumming and playing folk songs and Bob Dylan and all that stuff. I met a friend who had turned me on to fingerstyle and finger picking. And fingerstyle allows me to play all the bass runs and pick the melody and sing at the same time. Uh, Maladois in French means my fingers hurt. Obviously it's spelled more phonetically than the actual French way, because if we tried to use the French spelling, people would not uh, not be able to pronounce it. Uh, what next? I don't know, another record, maybe adding another musician for the upcoming festivals. If anything, learning more music is always the goal. Our thanks to photojournalist Christopher Habaker for putting that together for us. Malodwa just celebrated 10 years together, and their new album will be released this summer. You can catch them during happy hour this Thursday at Mickey's Tavern, as well as numerous other shows. Just go to their website, malodwa.com, for more dates and times.